Deluxe Programmer Socks, plus 255 coding skill, plus 127 furry, minus two toes, plus 15 cute. This stereotype is here for a reason, and I ain't judging. I mean, hell, those look kind of comfy. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Calibus! My name is Zen, with me today is nobody because it's me! Cam is currently away at PAX East, and we are I'm I'm left alone to look after all the kids. Hello, all of you. How you doing? Let's do a little bit of item shop! We know it, we love it. It's my wheelhouse. Let's get going. What kind of an enchantment does this spoon have? I don't know, but it looks like it's made of bismuth, and I love bismuth. That is incredible color. I feel like if I eat from that, it's gonna give me poison of some sort. I, either that or superpowers, and either way, I don't know, just, you know, I'll look it. The thing longer, plus five strength, plus seven reach. Ah uh, yes, for when I really want to get that deep scratch in that crack. Mmm, what is it, uh, what, what is this being used for? I'm assuming to become like Jack Skellington or something. Either way, really cool, really good for like costumes and whatnot. Really neat. Much like it'd be really neat if you went down below and make sure you are subscribed. Hell, check the Patreon as well if you want to get see behind the scenes and exclusive stuff. Man, I'm selling this so well. Oh man, mm, pat on my back. Yes, doing good. <laughs> First one is plus 10 explosive damage. Last one is plus three beam damage. All right, show me what, <laughs> gods. It's so unnecessarily extra. I'm kind of here for these. Like, I have no need for these. I ended up getting a Zippo lighter just because I like the clicky clacks. That is it. I don't smoke. I don't know people that smoke. Well, actually, that's a lie. I just don't socialize that very much anymore. <laughs> oh, God, I shouldn't admit that. Dude, that... Okay, that one's kind of sick. I actually kind of like that one. Ooh. Yes, the multiple for when you want to set your cigarette. Just ash. It's just ash. A crat, if you will. Plus three defense, plus two attack, minus five intelligence. No, unless this is a head crab, then that five, minus five is going to be minus infinite. Let's just get rid of that. But oof, I don't know. If, if, if cat like fish, crab kind of fishy, seafood. I don't know. There's a joke in there somewhere. Gender fluid plus 1000 gender. Universal high performance. Give. I want to know what it tastes like. Oh, lavender and lemon. Never mind. I know what it tastes like. What should it be called? Blunt bark slash wood weapon with splinter damage crafted from a fallen tree. That is so cool. That is. Yes. <laughs> this feels like. Okay. This feels like a machinist weapon from Final Fantasy 14. Kind of here for it. But the first, the first image. The first image almost looks like a gun blade. Can you please make it shoot little, just little wooden pellets? That'd be so cool. Oh, the flame katana. How did you? Plus 15 fire damage, plus 20% awesome, minus five weight, minus five base damage because it's made of wood. That is so, what? Oh, now that is cool. That is cool. How did you set it on fire? Please show me. Okay, so there's the lighting stick. There's there's the flint and the, the wool that's gonna probably light it up easier. Then you wrap it up. Oh, is it? Oh, is it like a one-time use kind of thing? And you have to do this each time? Whilst cool, very inefficient, but very cool. And the, there's the flint roller. Oh, so it's... Okay, so it, the roller is straight up in the hill. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> Towering Queen. If equipped during a chess game, the queen can move anywhere on the map in a 5x5 five five radius, as long as you sacrifice a piece each time you use it. Can jump over pieces. If defeated, the piece that destroyed it dies and it returns to a normal queen. This item can't be equipped multiple times per game. <laughs> You're trying to justify this, but this is unreasonable. <laughs> like it's pushing other pieces off their own board. <laughs> Glacial Spike, 85 damage, plus 45 crit rate, 100% uptime on freeze passive. When enemies are below 50%, they will gain status permafreeze. This effect will last until enemy dies. It's not stackable with other effects. Does not work against some bosses. What is that? Have oh, it's a stick. Oh, it sticks kind of around it. Oh, to give it like a little kind of hand guard. Oh, you. Oh, my God. Yes, please. Please. That's so cool. The spoon of silence. Every morning when I go into the kitchen, she yells at me nonstop, so I have to put the spoon on her head. You know what? No, I keep seeing TikToks about a person's cat that won't leave them alone until they turn on cartoons in the morning for them. So the spoon? Yeah, that makes sense. Somehow. <laughs> 
discount but better Yamato. Plus 30 crit rate increase. Plus 50 resistance to all elements. Plus 30 aesthetics. 100% motivation can be paired with white plastic chair. Knock off Sephiroth here. Wow. Where did you find this? The knife ring. Plus five damage. Plus one beauty points. <laughs> plus one beauty points. Okay. I feel like this might be illegal. Like straight up, this is a concealed weapon. This is a concealed blade. It might be used for like, uh, it's most likely used for like tailoring and whatnot. But I mean, anything can be a weapon if you, depending on how you use it. Uh, so I feel like these might not be illegal too much. Also making knuckle dusters out of this. Oh my God. Big harm the sun can do to him. <laughs> Big hat, 100% resistance to sun. Uh, how to tell if vampires are walking amongst us. Oh god, va vampire among us. Oh damn, among us is still polluting my mind. Dwarven scroll of tax evasion. Upon using this item will negate or stop you paying taxes. However, you will be hunted by a group of adventurers called the IRS. <laughs> Calling them adventurers feels wrong. Thieves? Yeah. Uh, maybe loan sharks is probably the better term. But oh my god, this thing is so cool. What is it? Metal plate scroll is the coolest thing ever. Top comment, yes. Yes, it is. I would want one of these and I would just hide it and keep it as like a family heirloom and tell nobody to open it. Generations down the line, when one of my descendants just opens it finally, like, what is upon the hidden scroll? And it's literally just dick butt. Who makes these? I need to commission someone. I might need to learn metal crafting. Energy potion. Do not, do not plug that into anything. Do not put that in electronics. It's gonna go badly. But at the same time, this makes, yeah, no. I've seen people drink really weird concoctions and call it an energy drink. This is pretty close to it. How to eat this would need a masterclass. Okay, what these videos, like people making all these big things, like they're not feasible to eat. It's for the spectacle and nothing else. And it's usually kind of a big waste of food. Cool, you're shoving it all in there. A bit of sauce, more sauce, more sauce. That's not gonna get even to the near the bottom of everything. Cool, yeah, cut it in half. You're just going for that cross section. How do you eat this? <laughs> How do you eat this? Because it the form factor, as soon as you cut off another little slice of that, it's just gonna all come boiling, boring out. It's, it's nothing. Just get a plate, put it in, give you a spoon. There's no point to this. Congratulations. This is a video that got maybe, I'd like to say 10K likes, and that's it. Nobody's gonna wanna try this because they're not gonna be able to eat it like it is. The L3R3 controller. Fundamental L3YL3. This is the controller you give to your friends when they come over. <laughs> we don't know where it came from. It just appeared one day and we've been kind of scared to use it. But now someone else is here, good luck. We get to finally see what it does. Giant cube made of motherboards, intelligence plus 200. Bonus effect can track you and your mother. <laughs> nah, I don't need that. But this is so cool. Oh, this feels oddly intimidating, but really, really cool. Mandatory Borg comment. But sadly, that's all the time we have for today on Calvis. If you liked the video, let us know down below. Hey. Which one was your favorite item that you would buy from a shop with fictional money? Hmm? If you want to see some more items, shop another one will be popping up on your screen in just a couple moments. But I've been your host, Zen, and I hope to see you in the very next Cowboys video. Uh, see you. <laughs>